Hello and welcome to the channel. Today we are taking a look at the collected edition of Hellboy The Bones of Giants. So Hellboy The Bones of Giants, it is hardcover, there is no dust jacket, it does have the usual type of gorgeous Hellboy artwork on the cover. It costs $25, 34 Canadian, about £21. I picked mine up from Forbidden Planet, so it was around about £14. If you want to go and check that out for yourself, I will leave a link in the description below. So what is Hellboy the Bones of Giants? When a startling discovery is made in Sweden, the BPRD sends Hellboy and Abe Sapien to investigate. What ensues is a wild adventure full of Norse legends, mythical creatures and a threat that could bring not just Earth but the nine realms of Norse mythology to their knees. Based on the illustrated novel by Mike Mignola and Christopher Golden, this hardcover collection brings readers into Hellboy's fight against the Frost Giants with stunning art by Matt Smith and colours by Chris O'Halloran. So this story essentially it starts out when a a body is discovered, um, a skeletal body in Sweden, which has a hammer with it, which appears to be uh, Molnir, or in other words, the hammer of Thor, the Norse god of thunder. Um, so Hellboy and other members of the BPRD turn up to help the scientists examining the body and of course no one can lift it uh, not because of it being super heavy or no one being worthy but because um, there are constant lightning strikes now whilst they're being told this Hellboy of course picks it up and then once he does he finds that he can't let go of the hammer and this of course then sets them off on their adventure which ties in with Norse mythology and features appearances from uh, dwarves and dark elves and what appear to be uh, Valkyrie and uh, talking creatures and the whole story uh, without giving everything away basically is all tied into the king of the frost giants and if you've read any amount of Hellboy you kind of know what to expect as the story ties in to myth and folklore typical kind of Hellboy story and a read that I certainly enjoyed. In addition to this, in the back of the volume we have a very nice Hellboy sketchbook with notes from Matt Smith. So that's Hellboy the Bones of Giants, that is it for this video, until next time remember hit the thumbs up below and I will see you in the next one.